Hey guys, Alex Khan here from Prince of Macedon Vlogs. I'm going to give you guys a quick, uh, spoiler-free review for Shang-Chi and the Ten Rings uh, MCU movie that just came out this weekend. And I gotta say, I, I really wanted to watch this for all the uh, the Hong Kong veteran actors that were popping out, like Michelle Yao, uh, Tony Loing, and the rest of the cast was fantastic. Um... But my favorite performance from this movie would definitely be a Tony Loing, who plays uh, Shang-Chi's father. And he shows a lot of good emotional range in this movie. Um, overall, I would say Shang-Chi would probably be my top four uh, favorite MCU movies of all time. Uh, number one for me would be a Winter Soldier. Number two would probably be Guardians 1, maybe 2. I guess Guardians 1 and 2 are kind of tied for me for second place. And then uh, Civil War would be number three. And then as number four would be this movie that just came out, uh, Shang-Chi, and the action scenes in this movie, I would say 90% of these action scenes are fantastic. I loved the, the, the bus sequence. You can see a part of that in the, in the trailers. And then there's another, uh, action scene not too long after that scene, which is pretty darn good too. Um, uh, BMW did, did pay for, uh, product placement, I'm assuming, because they had three, uh, cars featured in this movie. They have an I-8, which you see in the trailer, where it gets smashed. Uh, they have an M-8, which I don't know if they show that in the trailers, but there is an M-8, which gets some pretty good uh, uh, screen time. Uh, briefly, but it's very, very obvious that it's BMW paid for, to have that car right there, uh, center focus. And, uh, ooh, someone just, someone just dropped over here. Looks like Shang-Chi's sister. Um... And then also they had an iX3, which was also in the movie. But I gotta say, the iX3 was portrayed very poorly in this movie. It belonged to another character, so they added some uh, some physical uh, mods to make it appear unique. But it looked like trash. It was the worst looking car movie I've seen in any movie. It was just trashy. It was juvenile. It, it it felt like a kid designed the uh, the the appearance of the car, and uh, honestly, it's it, I, I just I just couldn't believe it was on screen for so long because out of all the BMWs they showed, the the iX3 was shown the longest, and it looked horrible, absolutely horrible what what they did to that car. Um, oh, what else to say? Uh, the movie is actually pretty funny, not just Aquafina, who you expect to be funny. Uh, but even uh, the main guy, uh, uh, Sima, Sima, I don't know how you pronounce that, but the guy who plays Shang-Chi, he was pretty darn funny too, and there's some pretty good cameos, uh, there are two, um, post-credit scenes, which you need to stay in the, uh, in the theater for, there's one, like, midway through the, through the credit roll, and then one at the very end of the, the credit roll, so make sure you stay tuned for that, um, yeah, overall, this movie was fantastic, again, probably my fourth favorite. Um, if there's any faults in this movie, I would say the final climactic scene felt a little uh, overblown and kind of uh, numbing to the senses. It is, it, it was just too much, I think. But uh, that's not really a weakness. I mean, if, if it had any weaknesses, that was probably it. That and then the way they portrayed the iX3. I don't even like BMWs, but the way they showed the iX3 was, it was criminal. I, I don't know what Marvel was thinking when they said, hey... Let's get our most creative guy, and let's see how we can make this iX3 look very unique. Absolute trash. Anyways, the movie's great. Action sequences, probably, uh, if not one of my favorite Marvel action scene scenes. Uh, maybe the absolute favorite uh, action scenes in an MCU movie. Um, I would have to go back and watch it, but right now, that there were two big action scenes in that movie, which I loved. Absolutely loved. Um, but this movie was gorgeously shot, and... Again, I, I love <laughs> I love the action sequences. So that's it. Uh, tell me what you guys think of the movie. Uh, be spoiler free because there are spoilers to be had.